To get the most out of your Spectra Precision LR60, follow this procedure for proper setup. Before installation, review the features of the Spectra Precision LR60 receiver. For the installation you will need the Spectra Precision LR60 receiver and MM1 magnetic mount, a rotating laser and tripod, a handheld detector, and either a grade rod or a tape measure supplied with the LR60. Begin as you normally would start a typical job and dig down to the required depth. Place the grade rod or tape measure into the bottom of the trench and use the detector to record the laser's on-grade height. This important information is the setup length. Write down the setup length in inches or meters as you will need to enter it into the LR60 later. Determine the bucket position you want to use when checking grade. This bucket position is the reference position and must be repeated when checking grade for accurate readings. Many users prefer the full open bucket position. If your preferred reference position is somewhere between full open and full closed, spray paint can be used to mark the desired position on the bucket's hinge. Withdraw the bucket from the trench and extend it outward and low to the ground. Make sure that the bucket teeth are in the reference position, in this case, the full open position. Use the grade rod or tape measure to indicate a line from the bucket teeth to a convenient MM1 mounting location on the dipper arm and mark its position. This could take two people. Attach the magnetic mount to the dipper arm, aligning it to the mark. This ensures the mount is properly aligned to the bucket teeth and is an important requirement for accurate ACE readings. Use the grade rod or tape measure to double check the alignment angle of the magnetic mount, making sure that it's pointing to the bucket teeth. Attach the Spectra Precision LR60 receiver to the magnetic mount so that the center triangle on the back of the receiver corresponds to the setup length. Now, enter the setup length you recorded earlier into the LR60. Notice the small numbers on each side of the display. The numbers on the left are in meters and those on the right are in inches. Locate the number on the scale that corresponds to the setup length. Press and hold the plumb switch to enter the setup length. Release the switch when the LEDs are closest to the setup length on the scale. An LED blink will confirm the settings in approximately two seconds. The value has now been set. To summarize the five setup steps, one, determine the bucket's reference position, open, closed, or other. Two, measure and record the setup length. Three, install the MM1 at the correct angle so that it's pointing to the bucket teeth. Four, clamp the LR60 to the MM1 so the center triangle is at the setup length. Five, enter the setup length into the LR60. While in ACE mode, center on grade is automatically activated and cannot be changed. Set the LR60 to the desired accuracy to match the job site tolerances. Complete accuracy setting and adjustment instructions are found in the user's manual. During excavation, regularly check the depth by putting the bucket in the reference position. As long as the Spectra Precision LR60 receiver is receiving the laser strike, grade can be accurately checked. For more information on the Spectra Precision LR60, please visit www.spectra-productivity.com.